Hey, what's up guys? Aaron here and today's video is the Amazon Fire Phone, everything you need to know. So during an event on Wednesday, Amazon unveiled their very first smartphone called the Fire Phone. And just like all the leaks suggested, there is multiple cameras on the front of the device. Now the Fire Phone has a 4.7 inch 720p display, 2.2 gigahertz Qualcomm 800 processor with two gigs of RAM and runs Fire OS 3.5, which is a modified version of Android 4.2 Jelly Bean. It comes in 32 or 64 gigabytes of internal storage. It also has dynamic image contrast, as well as a circular polarizer. The company says that you can even view the display with polarized sunglasses on at any angle. Now the phone has a rubber frame, aluminum buttons, and a glass back. And when it comes to the camera, we have a 13 megapixel rear facing camera with an f2.0 aperture. Now at the Amazon event, they did boast that the Fire Phone's pictures look a lot better, cleaner, and crisper than the iPhone 5S, as well as the Samsung Galaxy S5. Now on the front of the device, we have a 2.1 megapixel camera. Now what's special about this phone is a feature that Amazon's calling dynamic perspective. Using the four front cameras at each corner, the phone can track the movement of your head and also know which direction you're moving the phone with more accuracy. This allows for full control over your smartphone using just your head and one hand. You can tilt, swivel, and peek to open menus, options, and notifications. So using this unique sensor system, the phone can respond to how you hold the device and move your head. You can also auto scroll on a web page by just tilting the device up or down. The Fire Phone also features 60 frame per second 3D effects throughout the entire OS. Then there's the Firefly feature that lets you point your camera at magazines, ads, printed text, music, movies, games, food, etc. And Firefly will automatically identify it and is there to provide more information on the subject or convert the image into data. So for instance, you can point your camera and then press the dedicated Firefly button. They'll save that name, address, and location that's being posted on top of the ad for later. Now the dedicated Firefly button is the camera button but it does work different in different software scenarios. Amazon's amazing customer service called Mayday is also available on the Fire Phone. You can talk to a live tech representative right there on your smartphone, and they can help you out by drawing on your screen or completing a task for you. And that service is available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. And finally, you get Amazon Prime two-day free shipping, Prime Instant Video with unlimited streaming, as well as downloading of TV shows, Prime Music with unlimited music streaming, and over 500,000 books for free. You also get free photo storage via Amazon Cloud Drive. This is all free for 12 months with the Fire Phone. But after that, it'll cost you $99 annually. Now you can buy the Amazon Fire Phone at AT&T for $199. Now if you don't like contracts, you can buy your phone for $649 off contract. And that's gonna be for the 32 gigabyte model. It'll be $749 for the 64 gigabyte model. And delivery starts on July 25th. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for me on this one. Leave me a comment down in the comments section and let me know what you guys think about the Amazon Fire Phone. Now, this seems like a pretty good phone. The only thing I'm not really liking about this device is that it has a 720p display. So once again, guys, leave down in the comments section what you guys think about the Fire Phone. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, now's a great time to do so. Be sure to drop a thumbs up down below. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.